welcome back to the channel. This is Attack on Titan, the finale part one, or as Crunchyroll states, season part one. Wait, what is it? Attack on Titan final season, the final chapter, special one. <laughs> yes. So as we we're making our way through the last third of the this season, uh, last year, it was a situation where we saw a lot of comments popping up that said that there was too much source material that it probably wasn't going to get all wrapped up uh, before the end, of, I guess, of that third. But, you know, a lot of people said that it could be a movie. And, you know, with this being a one hour, like, special episode, I imagine that there's probably only going to be another single episode that's going to wrap up everything. Uh, I heard some rumors out there that that might not even come to the fall. Regardless, though, this show has been so amazing. And I don't count it as, like, my top anime just yet. I'm waiting for this finale to wrap up so that we can see how it ends. But right now it's number two. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is, like, number one for me. Depending on how this all wraps up, it'll probably usurp it, in my opinion. But I will say, even though we don't know any spoilers, I've heard that the ending of Attack on Titan is controversial. Now, I don't know what that could mean. Yeah, we've been actively avoiding spoilers like the plague yeah. for this. Um, so hopefully we can hold out after this part <laughs> until the next one. They're making it tough, but yeah. you know, we've been like dodging it. Like, <laughs> I'm really excited to see what, what's going to happen here. I feel like we're probably going to leave on a cliffhanger. We obviously saw uh, Aaron make his way here with all the Titans, all the colossal Titans, about to destroy Marley. Everyone is kind of making their way to him. I don't know if they're going to be able to beat him. I don't think so, but I mean, you would think that they would have to because now that he is the antagonist, they're going to try and take him out. But how are they going to have the strength to take him out? I don't even think that, um, you know, all the Titans that they have combined right now isn't going to make a dent. So I feel like it's going to be a situation where they're going to have to kind of reason with him. Um, I compared... Uh, Aaron Yeager's journey to that of Anakin Skywalker and I don't think that there's probably going to be like a redeeming moment for Aaron that's going to allow him to just kind of stay in the group which I don't even think that would have been the case anyway because he kind of has like a death sentence on him anyway since he took on the uh, the attack titan but with that being said I'm hoping that there could be like a Darth Vader come to the light type moment mm -hmm. there at the end and if it's going to be anybody, I feel like it's going to be Mikasa and Armin that are going to have to reason with him. Because um, even though he's had like these other friendships and these relationships, no bigger relationships, in my opinion, has he had than with Armin and with Mikasa. All right, let's go ahead and get into it. I think this is all going, like, taking place in his head right now. Maybe. While he's still doing this attack. <laughs> Probably because he's like decimating Marley right now. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Just the phrase, the rumbling, yeah. like elicits something. It elicits. <laughs> Are they about to get like. I feel like destroyed, or yeah. something. Because weren't one of these the kids that they saw? From before, yeah. right? Like when they visited, when like Levi saw the clown yeah. and shit, and they like ate and drank with them. I feel like they're about to be killed. Oh, oh they're running, gosh, they're yeah. running. Oh my gosh, they don't even know what's about to happen. Oh, you hear it. The rumbling. I feel like I already oh want to cry already, oh my gosh. But it's like, I want to cry to sadness and epicness at the same time. Mm -hmm. Oh my oh gosh. Oh my gosh. That looks like amazing, that shot. Is this like a vision he had? Oh. I mean, he sees the future. Oh. Okay, so this is when they went when to come visit. When they were there. Yeah. Oh my gosh, like he already knew what he was going to do. Oh my gosh. Are we going to like eventually cut back to him being like stepped on or some shit? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's about to die. You don't even oh, stop. No, 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 no. There's money's worthless at this point. Oh my gosh. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh. oh my gosh! But he's like seeing it happen yeah. like to him right there. It just. Oh my 
gosh. Oh, shit. Wasn't that like the poster for this too? Oh. Like the footprint? That is so freaking wild. This is why the whole world was scared of the rumbling. Yeah. Oh my. It's just like in an instant, it just, everything. Like, I don't even know how you get away from it. Like, I guess anyone who flies, like, in the freaking plane could go, like, go over them and land behind oh, them and they'll just like, keep going. they're, like, in jail and they're gonna just... Uh. <sighs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they're, like... There's no way anybody's getting away from this. Oh my gosh. Didn't even matter. Ugh. It's like you knew it was gonna be bad, but to see it yeah. is like crazy. Oh, his legs look oh, interesting. they're like small. Yeah. <laughs> but like not really, because yeah. look how big it is, but it's just like... Not what I was anticipating seeing. Oh my gosh. The music is like haunting. Like... Oh, whoa, Aaron. Gosh, it's just like hearing this and then like seeing this. It's just like insane. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And they're just looking at him with like horror. I didn't expect to get this emotional during this. I mean, guess what did I expect? Mm. I don't know. We'll see. What was that phrase we just watched in something like you could sometimes to save someone you have to kill them or something? I don't know. What was that from? Uh, we just watched something that said that quote. You know, it's funny. That I. I don't think it's the same thing we're thinking of, but I think they just said something similar to that in the Avatar finale. <laughs> I mean, you've been kind of out for the count for two years, Levi. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Levi, I think you might have to sit this out. Oh my god, he's such a badass. <laughs> Too bad Arwen didn't actually get to see like the truth of the world. Who's Who that? Oh, what's his face? Oh, I forgot his name. Yeah, me too. Oh! Oh! Oh my God! <gasps> okay. Damn! Flock. That's what it was. Yeah. I knew it started with an F. Oh my gosh. The entire friggin' the time? It ruined... Uh, Dang. That was probably the point. Y'all got some flex seal? It's like every time they lose... Oh, rumbling. Oh my gosh. Y'all ain't gonna have an hour. Oh no. That's crazy that Flock just showed up just like yeah, that. Like, he held onto the freaking ship the entire time. <sighs> our, our what? Only hope. Oh. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> they slipped. They fell. <laughs> well, they're gonna freaking. She's gonna have to get into the fight. But I just... Even just you by yeah. yourself is not gonna do much. Like one colossal versus like freaking thousands. You're not even anywhere near big enough when you tighten out. <sighs> oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh so what is Hanji about to go do? I feel like about oh to... my goodness! Uh, <laughs> I this yeah. I, it feels like this is like a goodbye, goodbye. Even though she has like a smile on her face, which makes you feel weird about it. Oh, oh my gosh. 
But like, how is she gonna slow him down? Yeah. <laughs> Is she even gonna really slow him down this much? You know, like, yeah, even if know. she was able to take out a couple of them. Dang, that's an insane shot right there. <laughs> I guess like you keep picking them off, but I mean, there's just so many. But you, you know, yeah, okay, it's like, so. oh, well, that was. It's gonna buy yeah, them time. Is it what is. it's really gonna do. But you know what? It's like, what are you gonna do? Just sit there and do nothing? Like you do mm -hmm. something, even if it's not gonna help that much. But you die fighting, right? Oh, wow. But this actually might buy them the hour they need. They're... Maybe is that they better speed it up and not just be a full hour. Dang Hanji, I love Hanji so much. She's a beast. Are we there? Okay. Okay. It it bought them time. Dang, they're stepping over each other. Oh my gosh. gosh. Can't you like make it and not I die? I know. Won't like you run out of gas at some point? I feel like it's gonna happen, yeah. Yeah, y'all gotta better hope it works. They're gonna get out of here by the skin of their teeth. Oh my oh. god. Oh my gosh. I'm just like not looking forward to it. I feel like it's gonna happen. Yeah. Like I feel like she's gonna die, and I just don't want that to happen. Oh no! <sighs> Getting forgetting the arm and vibes oh, from the. Oh my gosh. My gosh. <sighs> it's just like so quick too, because it's just like that's how it would be for them too. I it's know. just. Ow. Oh my gosh. Oh, We've lost so many people at this point. It's just crazy. Is that Hanji? Is that? What? what? Is this like as she's dying? But... Wait, what? I don't even know. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I like how it chills. <laughs> Look at everyone who died along the way. <laughs> See Erwin again. <laughs> the man you'd run through a brick wall for. Oh my gosh, why did they do that to us? I just can't. <laughs> Ugh, like an emotional mess. I just can't deal with it. Hmm. Like he actually would? Like the actual Aaron and not attack Titan. Yeah. It's possible that, you know, when you know he saw like the sky and it was like freedom and he didn't really see what was actually happening. Could be overpowering him. Mm. Yeah, because he's not controlling them. Yeah. That is true. I didn't even think of that. Maybe because it's like his own way of fighting himself. Mm -hmm. You know, like he's like thinks I have to do this because I've seen it and it's yeah. my power. But interesting. Uh, Maybe I feel like yeah. that is what he wants. Whoa. I don't know. He just transferred y'all back to this plane. He's like, no, that's not what I want. Don't do it. Oh my gosh. No. So the answer is no. Yeah. Oh. Little him. Little baby him. Oh gosh, Aaron. <laughs> What the heck? Is that them? What? Oh, they oh. just ran in a circle. Oh my gosh. So it's like... Crazy. Oh my gosh. Well, that is not what y'all thought he wanted. Unless... <laughs> 
Oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Uh, you have freedom. So that might be the him saying that, you know? Maybe his way of saying yeah, it. Yeah, like, if you wanted to stop, then kill me. Right, like, you have the... Because I guess he's his whole purpose is giving them freedom. Mm. But his version of freedom is taking out everybody yeah. else's freedom. Yeah... Like your best bet is to like get back on the train and go back. I don't know. But here comes everybody, right? Oh, I don't. I mean, okay. I don't know how much it's gonna do though. I don't think anything at all. But like I said, they're going down fighting, you know. Niximi's <laughs> kind of parallels that conversation Annie was having on the boat, too. By the time you realize it was too late. Wow. Wow. I mean, that's pretty big. I know. But, like, for Aaron, is it too late, you know? I mean, it's too late for Aaron. <laughs> I feel like what's going to end up happening is what's going to... Everyone's going to galvanize together to take out Aaron, and that's like, going to solve gonna racism like, in this world. <laughs> oh, my gosh. If he takes out all the ships just like that... It's like, little did Aaron realize he's single-handedly bringing everyone together. <laughs> Oh, okay, no, they're... So how much that damage big? is it gonna do? Yeah. Yeah, what was that? Was that like... It looked like he was about to shoot like a freaking hyper beam at their control. ass. Control... Oh, it's... Zeke! Oh, Zeke. Oh my gosh, he's gonna start throwing shit! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, wow. <laughs> I knew that guy wasn't very confident when he was saying that. They made it nonetheless. Yeah, I mean... Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. I mean, they're gonna glide in. So is that why Falco saw a sky? Because he was, like, up there? Maybe, yeah. I was thinking that. Yeah, I was thinking that, too, but I was, like, not fully sure. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Here we go! <laughs> it's gonna end soon. I know. Like, I don't so even long. think we're gonna even see this fight. Freaking Levi as he's, like, on his last leg. And his last two fingers. <laughs> Oh, he ripped him off. What does that mean, though? Like, if he's not, like, connected, uh, connected can he still control him? <laughs> They're working together. They were working yeah! together before y'all even started. I don't know why that gave me chills, too. It's just like, you know, I don't know. Everybody coming together, and it's just... So, I have been, it's against Aaron, too, so it's, like, weird. Yeah, I, know. <laughs> I don't know how to feel. I mean, obviously, I don't like what Aaron's doing, but it's... Mm. But he's still our Aaron. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah. I feel like the next part of the season, or the action, action, whatever, action. Whatever the next part of the what is this the a special? I the finale? Guess. The last episode. It's gonna of the go last crazy yeah. in six months. Something <laughs> whatever we see in nine months. So I feel like the first thing to be brought up here is that fact that we lost Hanji. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hanji was one of my favorite characters, mm. and I feel like it was an epic way to go out, buying them time. Because mm. it's over the course of everything, it's like everybody's kind of done little things to kind of pick away almost at the big problem here. Yeah. Like even going all the way back to like Irwin's death. Like, everything has slowly progressed them to, to this point here. Um, I mean, give, given, like, Irwin's... That was, like, before Aaron did all this stuff. Yeah. But it's, like, it still has affected things now. And we didn't like, even know what we were fighting, really, yeah. back then. But now, everything that everyone's doing is to stop to save the world, yeah. basically. And, I mean, it's just, it's so crazy that we've gotten to this point where Aaron is literally, like, the villain. Yeah. Um, but it's, it's you all, I guess, I don't know how everybody else feels about Aaron, but, like, we still like Aaron as a Aaron. character, so it's just so hard to watch. Obviously, I don't like what he's doing, and I don't want him to kill the world mm. at all, but it's so difficult because it's, like, these were his friends and everybody, and 
here he is just like rumbling over the world and everybody's coming together to stop him. <laughs> it's like little did he know he would bring the world His together. His death and destruction is bringing world peace between everybody else. Everyone's like reflecting on all the decisions that they've yeah. made and it's all, I feel like it was destiny for this show. Obviously it's the way it's written as well, but like all these events were to transpire because this predates anybody who was like living this time. You know, the Attack Titan, all these Titans. It's been like generations of buildup that has led to this moment in time. And it's just honestly awesome story writing. And I've, I've made the parallels with Anakin Skywalker and Darth Vader, but I mean, it's it's there. You yeah. can see it yeah. this, very he's clearly. Like literally the Anakin of anime. Exactly. So, and yeah. you can't say that you didn't root for Anakin, too. So yeah. that's like the, con the conflicted part that you feel internally. That's how I feel. I said it during the episode, but, you know, if we would have stopped at Marley, I'd be like, okay, you know, we, this is like kind of what the, I guess the the initial plan was, okay, the rumbling is going to be like a show of strength. Nobody's going to want to mess with you. At least that's what some people's idea of what was actually going to happen were. I feel like it was like the, the Mikasa, the parody part of like the group that actually was previewed to, I guess, that plan. Um, I would have been okay with that. Obviously, there was probably going to be a lot more collateral damage uh, with Marley. And, you know, you can kind of go back to the very first time that Bertolt and uh, Rhina showed up and broke through the walls. Yeah. There was a lot of collateral damage yeah. there too. So there's blood on everyone's hands. Like there's not a single person on this show that hasn't made mistakes that has led to this point. Um, it's just, you know, it's it's sad. And, you know, to see Aaron um, give them the freedom because that's, I guess, what he's really trying to attain. Still, I kind of take it the way that Rhina took it a little bit, even though he said, like, you can't talk me down. Maybe but like, you can strike me down. To, yeah, <laughs> like you're gonna have to kill me, basically. Yeah. I think that it's oh it's setting up for a very poetic ending. It's literally that phrase, sometimes to save someone you have to kill them. Oh yeah. We watched something recently and the phrase was something along the lines of sometimes in order to save someone you have to kill them. Yeah. I don't remember what it was from, but I feel like that is so applicable to this moment. <laughs> Not that I want them to kill Aaron, but I mean, what else yeah. are you gonna, you can't talk him down, you can't be like, Aaron, yeah. would you like to have some tea and discuss <laughs> it? Like, what else are they gonna do? He's not gonna stop. You know, it's kind of funny because I mean, I know I'm gonna be spoiling Star Wars here, but if you haven't seen Star Wars, then like, just stop go watch go Star watch Wars, it. yeah. But, you know, and in the end, where Luke was still trying to bring Vader back, Vader came back in a sense, but, he had to be taken down as well too because after doing all that you can't really just come back down and party with the Ewoks and be like hey the Empire is done right. so yeah. I always kind of felt that this is where we were leading to once we were starting to get the the clearer picture that this is you know Aaron as the antagonist it's just funny that it's bringing the world together as well so in a way he did bring about world peace <laughs> I know. <laughs> if they're like, able to beat him. Through death and destruction, he brought them together, given there's so much already that he's done that it's like, yeah. is it, like, like you said, how would he, if he were to stop and be like, wow, I messed up, how would he come back from that? You just killed so many people and like killed, just trampled over them. Like, yeah. what are you going to do? Just go like sit with them and eat? You know, it's just... Uh, real quick, spoilers for Code Geass. Code Geass spoilers. If you don't want to hear Code Geass spoilers and how they relate <laughs> to this. But do you get like a little bit of like Lelouch here with like Eren? Like, because you know, he had to kind of like sacrifice himself there. What if Eren is fighting yeah. the Attack Titan internally and saying oh, like, me. kill me? That's kind of what Rhino was going it to could. at first. It could, it could be like, since this is kind of his destiny in yeah. a sense. And hit the like almost the child part of him that was so just wanted to see the outside, just wanted freedom, yeah. and that was it. See what was it's beyond like, the wall. It's almost like his idea of freedom has gotten corrupted and distorted mm -hmm. to be like free, like freedom for us means I have to kill you, everybody, yeah. because no one can stand in my way. It's like maybe he is trying to just get back to his original I mean, child self. We saw him with that kid, like apologizing profusely for what he was going to do. It's it's crazy to think about everything that he knew like was going to happen as he was going there as like, you know, that last, I would call it sweet moment we had is when we had that flashback when they actually visited Marley, they were in disguise yeah. and they got to drink and eat and they, it was just like really fun. And, you know, it was done after we had already seen a lot of tragedy and everything that happened this season, but it just felt like really nice. And there was that moment 
where he asked Mikasa what I what I am to you, and then she never really gave the answer. Obviously, I feel like you know she loves him and like loves him in a romantic sense, not just like as a brother. Yeah. Um, and I, I feel like at this moment in time, the last thing I could hope for is like a little moment there at the end with Aaron, um, and you know maybe they could share that little moment together. But I do feel like it's going to end up being Mikasa that has to to end Aaron, in my opinion. Um, but you know if that is is the case, I feel like it's going to be very poetic and. I feel like, you know, the writing of this entire series has been so well done. And I just, you know, maybe I guess, like, I, I'm not sure. We don't want spoilers. Don't write any spoilers yeah, or anything yeah, like that for the finale. Them, but... uh, we're not going to look forward, obviously, to the manga. We've made yeah. it this far, so we're not going to look into it now. But if the controversy behind it is that, like, Aaron gets killed, is that the controversy? You know, like, oh, Aaron dies, and then... Like, oh, well, this is our main protagonist. But, like, if you don't see that, that that's coming. Like, I think, like, the, the controversy would be, like, if he wins. Like, I know. Now, like, like, if Aaron like, wins. Dang! Like, he's wiped <laughs> out the world. I don't It's I don't just know. crazy. I mean, I feel like, uh, first of all, I could see that happening. Like, this, That'd be this anime wild. is so crazy. I could see him, like, getting what he wanted, mm. which would be wild. But I could also see him getting killed. Yeah. Um, it which could go either way. Could, would be expected, and it would be bittersweet, but I feel like it would kind of just make sense for the ending. Something super poetic that I kind of envisioned in the last part of this season was what if Aaron were to die and then you know how like the 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 titans transfer into somebody mm -hmm. else if they don't get eaten and then you see like another child wake up one it's day like you see like a glimmer in the eye or and something it's just like a freaking attack titan like yeah and then like and i know that like would sound <laughs> it'd be super bad because you know that like oh the cycle is going to repeat itself right. but there would be something a little poetic in that as well too just be like right. the attack titan's always the coming song, it's like do 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 i think that'd be really cool i don't know if they would go there yeah. but that'd be kind of uh you know that'd be crazy if like okay there is that closure and aaron's dead it brings the rest of the world what's left of it together and then another attack titan is like popped mm -hmm. up in some newborn eldian yeah that'd be crazy watch it be like the child of armin and annie or something. Oh, <laughs> all right well thank you so much for watching we'll see you next time bye everyone